so this is my braiding pattern this is how it looks i did african threading so if you don't know how to do african threading i have a detailed video which i will link up here so you guys can check it out if you want to learn how to do african threading and i also did like two braids right in the front here this is where i'm going to have my parting so i decided to just do like two small braids but then i continued with african threading going all the way back so that's how i did my braiding pattern and it works perfectly for short hair so if you have short hair and you want your hairstyle to last try do african threading it's the best and the hair that i'm going to use today is this hair by afrotex it's called afro classic and it's in 16 inches and you can do like a lot of hairstyles with this hair you can do like crochets which is what i'm going to do like i want mine to look like this like what the model has here but i'm going to do a middle part of course and you can do like twists and stuff like different hairstyles and it's a one pack solution i think for twists you might need to get more but uh for this hairstyle that i'm going to do which is what the model has here it's a one pack solution so i hope one pack will work for me but i have another pack just for backup and i got mine in color number one i got it from cosmetic connection i will link it in the description box below i don't remember how much it was i bought it like a month ago but i will link it in the description box below so yeah let's get started so this is how the hair looks i'm just gonna take one bundle it comes with three and to do this hairstyle you're gonna need a crochet needle which looks like this and it has like a little large hook here and a closure so you can pull your hair nicely so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and get started i'm gonna start this side to do this hair i'm going to go ahead and start right here in the front so i just put my needle through and hook the hair close the latch and pull through and then grab the hair through the loop here and secure it like so the next piece of hair i'm going to hook it on the latch here close it pull the hair And then pull the ends of the hair through the loop like so. and then pull it to, to secure it like so so I'm gonna go ahead and do the same for my whole entire head except for the two braiding lines here and then here I'm going to do like an invisible parting
So I am done with most of the hair. Let me show you the back. So this is how the back looks. And the sides like it's really, really full. So now I'm left with the invisible part portion here. So to do the invisible part, you put your um, uh, needle and then put the hair through, close it and then pull it through. And then once I have my hair loop here, I'm only going to take one side of the hair. I'm not gonna take both of them. So take one side, make it tight, and then the other side will cover the track. So again, taking my large hook, putting it through, and it's going to be a lot more close compared to what I did with the African threading here. So put the hair through the loop, close it, pull it through, and only pull one end like so and the other end will come on top and cover the braid so that's what I'm gonna continue doing now So I am done with this side. As you can see, it looks really, really nice and clean and natural. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this side now. Hook the hair, close it, pull it through. And then again, I am only pulling through one end. Like so, and then the other one will cover the braid. So I am done installing all the hair. This is how it looks. And this is the path. So this is the back. Like it's really, really full. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to just comb it out with my fingers like so. So I'm finger combing and also like trimming off the ends
so yeah this is the final look i really really love this hair i don't know how long i'm gonna keep it though because it's really really hot um but we'll see maybe i will keep it for at least two weeks so yeah this is how the back looks and all the sides i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and don't forget to enable the notification bell so you don't miss any future uploads and i'll see you guys on the next one bye